Alright, there we go. Delicious meal. Hello and welcome to Home Cooking Spain. Today I'm going to be showing you what I can cook with some leftover boiled potatoes. So let's begin. Okay then, so for this meal I'm going to be using these leftover boiled potatoes from yesterday's lunch. I've also got here about four um, garlic cloves chopped up, about half an onion and some red pepper. I'm going to be using also some sweet paprika, some thyme, black pepper, salt and some good old olive oil. So let's begin. Oh, by the way, this is the cake that I made this morning, sponge cake. Turned out a bit dodgy, but it should be okay. Dodgy as in dodgy looking. Doesn't mean dodgy tasting. I'm sure it'll taste good, but my wife will let me know anyway. By the way, forgot to mention, we're gonna be eating them with fried eggs. So, we'll start off by turning the stove on. I'm going to turn up to medium high, which is number seven. And I'm going to add about oh, three tablespoons of good old olive oil. And we'll wait for that to heat up. And in the meantime, while we wait for that to heat up, we'll pour ourselves a glass of wine and wish all my subscribers a good day. Cheers. So when the oil is hot, what I'm going to do is add the onion, peppers and the garlic. And what we'll do is just um, gently fry it all off until it's nice and soft. Right, so once everything is nicely browned and nicely softened up, what I want to do is take all this out and put it on a plate. I want to keep the oil in the pan. Okay. Wait a minute. Let me give this a wipe. Or else the... It's going to smoke, isn't it? Right, so I'll keep this to one side. And in this same oil, I'm going to add the potatoes, the boiled potatoes from yesterday's lunch. And what I want to do is fry them off, make them nice and toasted on all sides. So I'll leave them there for about five minutes and then I'll turn them over. Right, so the potatoes have been here for about eight minutes roughly. And you can see they're starting to nicely crisp up. So what I'm going to do, it's a bit awkward here, I'm going to turn them all over. And brown them on the other side. And once they're all turned over, I'm going to add some salt, just a little bit, because I did add salt to these yesterday when I cooked them. And I'm going to add in the 
peppers, onion and garlic as well. And whatever juice is here. Let's spread them all about. Lovely jubbly. And I'm going to add some black pepper. The following herbs that I'm using, they're optional. Some thyme. It's half twelve by the way. Nice sprinkle of thyme. And of course, some sweet paprika. And I'm going to cover that up and leave it there for 10 minutes. Well, the 10 minutes have gone by and I'm going to give this a move about. Oh, nicely toasted. Gorgeous. And after moving them about, I'm going to cover them back up and leave them there for five minutes and they'll be ready. So while that is there for five minutes, I've got a small pan here for frying my eggs. So I'll turn the heat up and I'm going to add some oil. This oil it's what I usually use for frying chips and frying eggs. It's slightly red, but that's because it's got the chorizo and paprika taste. So we'll wait for that to heat up before chucking the eggs in. I'm going to fry my eggs now. Obviously, everyone fries their eggs to their own liking. So don't leave me any silly comments saying I've got too much oil, they're not crispy, they're raw, they're too done, etc. And I like to add salt to mine. And also I like to sprinkle some paprika over them. And what I like to do well, it's how I have always done them. It's how they've always been done. When I was small, learning from my grandparents, is to do this so that the oil goes over them until the yellow bits turn white. There we go. Delicious meal. And here is today's delicious meal using leftover boiled potatoes. Well, I hope that you have enjoyed today's recipe video. Please give me a like if you did so. Leave me any comments. And I look forward to sharing my next video with you. Thank you very much for watching. And goodbye.